skeletons, it is Disney Queen Skelly here, and welcome back to another Getting to Know Me. So we're going to do questions 26 through 50. Uh, here we go. Have you ever had a nickname? What is it? I've had a few. So my real name is Amanda. My nicknames have been Mandy, Skelly, Little Mouse, Mans, and Skelita. Do you like or dislike surprises? I do like surprises. Surprises are nice, especially when you torture the other person with them. In the evening, would you rather play a game, visit a relative, watch a movie, or read? In the evening, I actually prefer to be on my laptop, just chilling. But out of these events, I think I would rather play a game. I like playing games with hubby. Would you rather vacation in Hawaii or Alaska, and why? I've only ever been to Hawaii. I have never been to Alaska, so I would personally like to see what Alaska is like. Would you rather win the lottery or work at the perfect job, and why? Oh boy, that's actually a hard question. I'd rather work at the perfect job because if it's the job that you were working for, if it's the job that you've been wanting, it's definitely worth it and it'll feel like you've won the lottery with every check you get. Who would you want to be stranded with on a deserted island? I would want to be stranded with hubby, with Harley Baby's hubby. And the only reason why is because he's very smart, he's very resourceful, and he's just intelligent with what his surroundings are. He's very good at learning. If money was no object, what would you do all day? If money was no object, I would travel. I would just, every day, every week, I would find a place to travel. If you could go back in time, what year would you travel to? I would travel to my first semester in college and stop myself from doing some things that I feel kind of regretful for. How would your friends describe you? Short-tempered, sweet, cute, pretty, beautiful. These are their words, not mine. Crazy, definitely not normal. <laughs> what are your hobbies? I like to write. Um, I do like to read. But, well, well, that's not really a hobby. I like to write. I like to do YouTube. That's pretty much all the hobbies I have is just writing and filming videos. I don't do much other than that. What is the best gift you have been given? That would be this train set that my mom got me for Christmas last year. It's a Nightmare Before Christmas train set, and each month they send you a new addition to the train. What is the worst gift you have received? That would have to be a repeat copy of a DVD I already owned. Aside from necessities, what one thing could you not go a day without? I, could, I know this is going to sound so millennial, but I, I can't go a day without my phone. And it's not the fact that I, ha I have to be off on my phone 24-7, it's emergency-wise. Because if something happens to me and I don't have my phone, then we have a problem because no one really has, like, you can find some pay phones out there, and, I mean, they, I'm assuming they still work, but at the same time, like, you know, the first thing people are going to notice when an unknown number calls is they're going to, they're not likely going to answer it because they're going to think it's spam or a scam. So you're better off just having your phone with you where people know your number. List two pet peeves. I hate when people bite their nails. That is just absolutely disgusting. And I, okay, I know people who have ADHD who this, you can't really stop doing this and that's fine. It's the leg bouncing. Hubby does it on the bed and it shakes and it just bothers me. Where do you see yourself in five years? Moved out, definitely moved out and hopefully planning my wedding. How many pairs of shoes do you own? I want to say around six to eight. If you were a superhero, what powers would you have? Ooh, okay, so we have multiple powers. I would love to read minds, um, I'd love to fly, and I would love to turn invisible. What would you do if you won the lottery? I would quit my job, give a third of it to my parents, and then put half of it into my savings. What form of public transportation do you prefer? Air, boat, train, bus, car. I prefer airplanes, I feel safest up in the air. What's your favorite zoo animal? I like penguins. If you could go back in time to change one thing, what would it be? Quitting my job at Knott's Berry Farm when I was a games attendant. If you could share a meal with any four individuals, living or dead, who would they be? Edgar Allan Poe, Shakespeare, uh, Michael Jackson, Tim Burton, and Danny Elfman. I thought I was just kind of thinking dead people. I'm like, wait, I said living too. <laughs> How many pillows do you sleep with? I sleep with three. Uh, one on the bed, one to stop my head from hitting the um, backboard, and one kind of on my side to stop me from hitting the wall. What's the longest you've gone without sleep and why? It was 22 hours and it was just a sleepover. What's the tallest building you've ever been to the top in? I think that would have to be the Guardians of the Galaxy attraction. I don't think I've been in a building any taller than that. 
Alright guys, I so thank y'all so much for watching this Getting to Know Me. I hope you're getting informed really well. If you'd like to answer any of these questions for yourself, let me know the answers in the comment section down below and which question you are answering so that way I can know. Bye little skeletons, stay safe. I love you guys.